And welcome back folks, welcome back to Let's Play Part, Planet of Death. In the last episode we won our first two races. And I had a slight problem in that I apparently cannot save the game for some reason. Maybe it's because I'm on easy. Even though that wouldn't make sense because if it's on easy then you should be even more able to save. Okay, so we can't save, we can only continue. We should um, preserve our car settings. So last time we have adjusted these settings. That finally enabled us to make much more progress and this yeah, only saves these settings. Okay. Uh, so we'll keep the settings and we'll just dive right into the next race. Yeah, that I can't say if it's a... Uh, not just a slight problem, but it's a big problem. Because that means that I basically... Yeah. Have to beat this game in one session. Or have to play up until the point where we left off every time I start a new recording. Which is equally equally awkward. Okay, however, we shall not be concerned with this problem. We shall be concerned with the problem at hand, which is the problem of ugh, which is the problem of beating of winning this race. Okay, and as you saw in the last in the last video, um, these racing tracks get a lot more difficult. Oh, we are now. This is now the third track, and this is much more intricate than the first one. The first one was basically a tutorial. Yeah, and so I failed the tutorial in the first three videos. Then, so the first track was very easy track, very straightforward. Yeah. This one is not so straightforward. This one is rather intricate. Yeah, and I already got confused. I was not sure whether to turn right or left. By the way, if you t if you go if I were to go into the wrong direction, the game would um, just blatantly will not refuse to let you play, but will show a big sign telling you wrong way, wrong way, Blah. wrong way, wrong way. Yes, much like in say Call of Duty, where it would say leave. You have left the combat zone, even though in Call of Duty. By the way, I never played. Um, you are actually getting. I think you die. You don't return to the combat zone within 15 minutes. Don't die here. You just lose the game. As you saw in the previous video, if you fall off some cliff here in this game, you just get respawned and lose a few seconds. Okay, I think. Okay, two more laps to go. And again, I was slightly confused. Uh, I almost turned right there. Okay, one more lap to go. And then we won. We won this. So there are 32 tracks um, available in this version of part, which is part gold. But I don't know how many tracks you have to beat in order to beat the championship and then hopefully get an ending cutscene. Um, I don't even know if there's an ending cutscene. Maybe there isn't. It would be awkward. Um, but yeah, I don't know. And I think I've won this. Uh, it's not right, not yet. Okay. Um, yeah, that would be awkward if there was no ending cutscene. But I've no 
never played. Well, I did play this game, but I never finished it. I only played the demo. Um, I think in 1997 when this game came out. I like the atmosphere of this game. That's basically why I remembered it. Um, and I've won this race. Yeah. Still can't save. Uh, so let's continue. And we have still eight minutes left. It should be enough to either win this race or to lose it. Yes, I like this atmosphere uh, of this game. But uh, since I only played the demo, which only contained, I think, the first track, um, that really only refers to the atmosphere of the first track. Okay, I can't. Um, I've never played this track, for instance. Now I do. I have to say that it sort of reminds me of. Um, Another racing game is the atmosphere, and this was okay, a bit tricky. The atmosphere and also the, the techno music or drum and I don't know what this maybe it's drum and bass, I don't know. Um, it's electronic music, okay? So it reminds me of another racing game which is similar in. Well, a bit similar in atmosphere and style, and music, and that is um, Wipeout. I was actually very, I was very um, not surprised. Um, okay, what's the word? I'm trying to think of the word. Not surprised. I was very delighted. That's the word. I was very delighted when I saw that there was a game for the Wii U called Wipeout and I thought wow they still make racing games for uh, a next gen console in the series no they don't Wipeout for the Wii U um, is not a racing game it's something completely different they just sort of got hold of the name um, yeah that was so if you own a Wii U, don't buy this game, don't buy Wipeout, at least if you do, uh, bear in mind that it's not a racing game. So Wipeout, um, I played, that was back on the PlayStation, PlayStation 1. I, re I really liked um, this game. In contrast to this game, you had you didn't have cars. You had, had traction with the ground, but you had sort of floating vehicles, not really flying, but floating, hovering above the air at a high speed. And it's featured music by, um, I think, by Project Pitchfork. Or not, no, no, not Project Pitchfork. Um, so the band that the band that made "Smack My Bitch Up" changed the pitch up. You know that song. Uh, I can't rem remember the name of the band. Okay, anyway, uh, they I think they featured music from this band, or at least it sounded like that band, that particular band, which I can't remember. A British, uh, British electronic band, which I guess still exists, but uh, yeah, maybe it exists and yeah, uh, don't lose this race, don't do it, don't do it. <sighs> and I won. Okay, that was very close. And I can finally save. Okay. So this is LP number four. Okay, for some reason 
apparently you can only save so many times. Um, now the problem is that, um, yeah, we've only three and a half minutes left. So I don't think I can manage to do another race um, in this time. Let us instead check the stats. Okay. Ranking of the four tracks. Okay, good. Um, so there's an, a total overall ranking, apparently. But I think you still have to win every race. But okay, then this is sort of pointless, isn't it? Okay. Uh, okay. Apparently, I don't understand this ranking. Um, well, I guess if you are. Um, you have to be on the first place, the total ranking, but if you win all the races, you should technically automatically be on the first place, I think. Okay. Uh, so they are very, okay, they are, apparently this guy is quite good. The Followed by these two people, and the uh, the rest are pretty rubbish, pretty much rubbish. Okay, team results. There are no teams. Okay, you've... I suppose that team results refers to maybe player versus player racing. I don't know if this game has multiplayer. Um, I'm sort of afraid to go to the main menu because I'm I'm kind of wary whether this save game has actually saved and we can but it has saved okay so i guess we just um i'll leave you here and when we come back folks we'll do the next uh race. yes so until next time folks until then